back on the Pan Am. Now going to Chincha. Yep, it's about 60k away. I'm not sure if we'll make it all the way, but it's census day, which means no one can uh, go on the roads. Everyone has to stay indoors. <laughs> We're having a quick break before we uh, go to that hill over there. Well, it's a big hill, it's that direction. So, um, quick chocolate break. <laughs> Another break. Woo! We made it to Chincha. End of day four, almost. And our longest day yet. Oh boy. We are bushed and so stoked. Whew. Uh, we did our biggest day yet. We've kind of splashed out tonight. Super sunburned. 60 kilometers, yeah, and half of it was uphill. Fucking hill up ahead! Ah! Also, we checked into a sex hotel. It was disgusting. So, <laughs> tip number one, don't be afraid to ask for your money back. And now, we're in a nice clean room with a little bit of luxury and breakfast included. So, when we were in Chincha, and you might recall that we had some trouble finding a pump for our bike because the valve didn't fit our, our bikes. We were in Chincha and met a really nice guy called Jorge. He was actually the owner of a restaurant we went to for dinner. And he offered to take us to somewhere to find a bike pump. Now we were like, oh, this is super nice of him. But then a little paranoid part of our brains like, what if it's a setup? We decided to split up. So I went with him and he took me to this market, like this big street market. And it was like being in Bangkok or something like that. Just little tuk-tuks and yes, they have tuk-tuks in Peru. And it was chaos, but it was fantastic. And we got the pump. And we got the pump. Always always try the flipping pump. Yeah, try the pump before you fly. Try before you buy. Yeah. 